Welcome. In front of me is an Alcatel 5V, and today I will show you how to bypass the Google verification screen. So jumping straight to it, uh, you will see right here that this is locked. So I'm going to progress to it, and uh, you might want to connect to the Wi-Fi before we begin, because we will need the connection anyway later on. So. So as you can see, uh, it requires a verification. So, I'm... so now let's go back to the first screen. And from here, tap on vision settings and enable talkback. Tap on it and enable it. Okay. And let's just mute that because we don't really care about what she's saying. So, once TalkBack is enabled, draw an L on the screen, so like so. Then tap on TalkBack settings to select it and then double tap on it to actually go there. Okay. And now what you want to do is hold the volume up and down together. So let's hold it to disable the talkback and use shortcut okay and do it once more and you should get a message on the bottom accessible shortcut uh, whatever so now we can actually use a normal touch on it instead of like clicking and what you want to go do is go all the way down to help and feedback. From here, uh, tap on the first uh, first option. So as you can see, it has a video, and that's what we're looking for. Um, that's why we also needed the internet connection. So once you tap on it, you can tap on the little clock icon right here. Um, accept. Uh, you don't want to sign in and now you're in the browser so tap on the search bar and navigate to hard reset that info like so go and from here tap on the three little bars here and select download And the search bar now we're gonna type in Android 8. Like so, and tap search. And as you can see, you have a first one. Tap on download. It will redirect us. Go down again and tap on again on the download button here. Uh, continue and now you will have to allow the download and also change it in settings probably. Okay, so here, when we're trying to install it, we need to grant the access to unknown sources. So once you flip that, you can go back and tap on install. Open the application once it's installed. And from here, what you want to do is tap on Google Ac Account Management APK install and install it for the version 6.0. And once more, enable unknown sources, so settings and flip it and go back and tap on install. Okay, so once it's installed, just tap on done. And now tap on the add one, bypass FRP, and select the browser sign in. And from here, you will see the three little dots over here. So tap on it, 
and select browser sign in tap on ok and now what you want to do is actually put in a email address from uh, Google so I'm gonna put in mine and tap on accept and now put in the password I'm gonna do the same but off the screen and once you put it in just tap on next and it will log in and immediately go back to the app as you can see and from here we're basically done so what we need to do now is hold the power key and reboot the device so just tap on restart right here tap on ok and wait for the device to reboot and once it's back on uh, as you will see we can progress now through the setup screen and uh, the device will think that the account that we just put in is the one that is previous and it will automatically progress as it's already logged in So let's go through it really quickly. I'm gonna skip most of it. What we will want to do anyway after this is do a hard reset of the device once more. And uh, after the second time, it actually will not require any kind of verification at all. And it will be done only to clear the phone of any kind of residue and all the apps that aren't really needed that we just downloaded. I'm gonna tap on skip, not now. And as you can see, we just skipped through everything and there was no verification of any sorts. I just logged in. <clears throat> okay, so now what you want to do is go into settings. So you have the little gear icon like right over here. Tap on it. Go all the way down into system. And you have reset options, so tap on it. And then erase all data, factory reset, the last option and reset phone on the bottom and erase everything and now I'm gonna do the hard reset so I'll be back once that is finished Okay, and as you can see now the reset has finished, so we're gonna go through the setup process once more. Setup as new. And as you can already see, we can skip the uh, Wi-Fi connection, which normally if, you were to, if the device would be locked, you have to actually connect to something. So, Okay, time zone, it's all good. As you can see, now it's all set up. And uh, just to go, I'm gonna show you the version of the phone or the Android. As you can see, Android version is 8.1 here number so that is basically how you bypass the google verification and uh, if you found this very helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching